Hello everyone, welcome to iOS Droid Arcade Gamers. We're gonna start another game today. This is uh, Little Orpheus. It's about a Soviet soldier. I don't know, it's a soldier or a worker. I think it's a worker. So this guy is uh, lost in the dinosaur world. And uh, it's quite a linear game, just go in a straight path, simple game to play. Quite fun. The best part is it looks amazing. Uh, fun to play. So I would recommend that you uh, watch it on a TV uh, or a big screen. The, the visuals are great. The audio effects are also great. And I'm personally using an Xbox controller uh, with the iPhone 12 Pro Max. So you can get this good uh, 18 is to 9 aspect ratio. It can fill your mobile screens or the TV screens. Well. I would have used an iPad otherwise, but the ratio would have been, uh, you know, 3 is to 2. Wouldn't have looked good. So sit back, relax, enjoy the game. Let's go. Okay, you scene. are comrade Ivan Ivanovich Privalov. In 1961, you were selected for the Shukovgrad Interonaut Exploration Programme SSSR. Despite failing your basic physical and being caught cheating on your entrance exams, <laughs> on the morning of the 12th of April 1962, you boarded a rocket drill containing the experimental device Little Orpheus with the purpose of descending through the Earth's crust to discover the relative hollowness of the interior and its suitability for colonization. Uh -huh. No, you've lost me, General. Did I do what? You and Little Orpheus were dropped into an extinct volcano to drill to the center of the Earth and find out if we could establish a city there. Wow. Note, if you will, that this date is over three years ago. Uh -huh. Let's see, we have come underground and trying to establish a new colony for Soviet Union to live inside. It's amazing, man. Ivan Ivanovich, can you describe Little Orpheus to me? Of, of course. <laughs> it was uh, large and round, round. <laughs> and had something of a disagreeable smell. I was referring to its technical specification. Well, General, I am no man of science, but it had this uh, radio thing that I was supposed to use to let the surface know I had arrived, and uh, some sort of battery wrapped in this lead box. But I was told to not touch anything under any circumstances. And I did notice the engineers who worked on it were quite a shifty bunch. The way he talks, huh? really funny guy. Hit the Lord, yes. Ah! I just had to jump. That's the good part about these games, you, just, you can just retry whenever you want. Okay, careful. The little yeah. Orpheus device contained a radio transmitter capable of sending a signal through miles of solid rock. In order to boost this, a powerful energy source was required. An atomic bomb, comrade Preval. An atomic bomb that you have lost. Oh, Somewhere lost below bomb. the Earth's crust. Ah, wow. yes. That bomb. <laughs> of course, oh. General, I can explain everything. But it is a long and uh, somewhat complicated I story. Mean, this guy know and what let he's me assure about. you, this is not a case of milking chickens. But you won't understand where your bomb and little Orpheus has ended up unless I start at the very beginning and you let me tell you where I've been for the last three years. Three years? That's a long time, my friend. I don't know if, if this guy is telling the truth or not. See the physics in the game? If I move around the rock, it tilts with my weight. <laughs> Amazing. Hard to believe you can 
play these sort of things on a mobile device. From the beginning then. But this had better be good. <laughs> good, General. It's more That's than good. Place. It's extraordinary. And wow. it began like this. Funny music? No. Yeah, these story type of games, man. I really miss them. I've been playing competitive games for a long time, but these story games, you, know, you just sit back and just enjoy the whole thing play out in front of you. No need to stress yourself out. Episode 1. So I've seen uh, 9 episodes uh, that are available in the game. An extraordinary sight! Uh -huh. I realized this must be the fabled land of Plutonia, as Plutonia. documented by the brilliant scholar Obrachev. A trail of destruction carved by the rocket drill led down into the wild and mysterious jungle. The rocket drill itself must have snapped in half somewhere below Kamchatka. Oh, 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 oh. And little Orpheus bounced out and became <laughs> lost in that prehistoric uh, forest. Luckily. If I was ever to get home, my this. mission was clear. To find little Orpheus. Yes, we're going to find little Orpheus. We will not let the Earth get destroyed by this nuclear bomb. Healed myself and plunged deeper into that prehistoric jungle where insects the size of dogs buzzed around. Dogs? What sort of dogs? I beg your pardon, General? Large dogs or small dogs? Big like an Avchanka or small like a Barlonka? Does it really matter? Of course. Detail is all important. Avchanka, then, General. The size of an Avchanka. I find that very hard to believe. Would you find it easier if they were the size of a balanca? No. But I am enjoying your attempts to persuade me. This general is more funny than him. Oh, come on. Oh, we'll try again. Yes. Oh, and time to jump. Ah, ah. Oh, you miss. Yeah, I'm, I'm jumping later, I think. Okay, let's try again. Yeah. Up. Go on, bring out the dinosaurs. Making Tarzan. No! Oh, we made it. I thought I lost it. Lost the what? Bail? In Hindi, that's what we call him Bail. Another part of the rocket drill. But still no sign of little Orpheus. Rocket drill. Coming down. Hurry up, hurry up. Save yourself, my friend. Whoa. Go, 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 go. Uh -huh. Just made it. Music is great, man. 
I love it. <laughs> this guy is so happy to be lost here. Ooh, first dinosaur. But this guy is lovely. And these are, I think, vegetarian ones. They eat only the plants and the between the trees. Trees. I could see huge beasts, larger and more ancient than any uh, known to our modern times. Could it be that Obrachev was right? And deep below the Earth's surface, prehistoric monsters still roam freely. Yes, yes, <laughs> but little Orpheus. <laughs> this guy's misleading his general to somewhere else. Oh, very good. Yeah. Oh, I missed it. Okay, let's wait for it. Wait for it, wait for it. Yeah. That's a dangerous one. T-Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Very dangerous the terrible one. lizard intent on making a snack of lizard. me <laughs> was none other than the most awful of the monsters. The Tyrannosaurus Rex. Oh, now you are an expert on dinosaurs. Oh, hardly an expert, General. Just educated by the best schools in the world, like all good socialists. And I remembered one crucial thing. I'm listening. Well, uh, its greed is without bottom. Its hunger is ferocious. But its brain is absolutely tiny. So it can roar and roar as much as it likes, but it will never be a match for the sharpened mind of the good Soviet worker. Uh -huh. All I needed was a plan to outwit the monster. That's what we're gonna do. Outward the monster. Hold B. I'm noticed. Okay, I can use this to jump. Yeah. Imagine my oh. shock and surprise to find in that clearing the last part of the rocket drill. More shocking was the fact it had been ransacked. Someone had made off with the tools, the weapons, the rations, and the spare parts for the Pragviev. What? I began to suspect foul play. Perhaps Little Orpheus was not lost at all, but stolen. Ooh. All I could do was follow the trail further into Plutonia. The thing is stolen. No one is playing games with us. Maybe it's the guy who just discovered this underground place that's doing something. Big fight. Not a fight actually, we have to just survive. We can't find this guy. Can't can't fight this guy. We have to survive this sh Okay, he's looking to the other side. Let's push. Go 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 run run run! So we 
all agree this was the fabled land of Plutonia, do we? I don't remember accepting that. I will admit it might not have been Plutonia uh, if you are prepared to accept the dinosaur. This isn't a negotiation, Ivan Ivanovich. General, you can disagree all you like, but there's very little you can do to persuade me it wasn't a dinosaur. I might not be able to persuade you, but I can always have you shot. What happened there? Ah, okay. We can push it from the other side, I think. Yeah. Actually, I'm, I'm looking at the computer's screen while I'm recording this. I'm playing the game. Okay, we can uh, jump over and... So the signal is going from the iPhone to the capture card and into the phone. Oh, into the PC, in the computer. Yep, yep. Get a better visual. Um, I need to look down as well. No. Can I go left? Uh, let's try. Maybe there's some secret over there. I'm not sure if they have uh, secrets in this game as well. the lowest you can come down. Oh, he's back. Go hide, hide, hide. I have this habit of saying push from Warzone. Instead of saying run, I'm saying push. Like you're going to, you're going to raid some enemy squad or something. Oh! <laughs> How did he find me? Now I get it, now I get it. Hopefully. I can hide in the bush. When he looks the other way, then I will go forward. Let's wait, let's wait for him. Wait, wait, wait. Patience. Okay, now. Stay here. Let's go. Go, 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 run! I'm not gonna take the risk. Let him look the other way, then only I'll, I'll go forward. Come on, look the other way. Why is he not turning away? Okay, he's looking down, so let's push up. And wait. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Is there a surface on the right? Yeah. There is. Dark scenes I have to see on the phone itself. I'll change my monitor's placement tomorrow probably. And for the next episode.
Eggs. <laughs> oh, he's stuck inside the egg. Pretend to be an egg. Stay still. I think I. I think yeah. Stay still in front of him. <laughs> as soon as he looked up, I, I stopped. Just like in the cartoon, it feels like I'm acting in a cartoon. <laughs> the music plays uh, with my feet movement. You see. The, whenever I step, the piano plays. Ting, 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 ting. <laughs> oh, that's really cool. Oh, okay, he's not interested. Did we survive? I think for now, we did. <laughs> nice, huh? In an egg. Yes, General. Mm -hmm. I hid in an egg. I am glad to hear your military <laughs> training was not wasted. If only I had a single legion of men as brave and ingenious as you, with only a hundred men equipped with eggs to hide in, we could roll across Europe in a day. <laughs> General, are you mocking me? <laughs> you are as sharp as you are brave, Talarish. Okay, I will just in the monitor a bit. Uh, much more easier for me to see now. Why is he tired? Suddenly. Okay. Some sort of person? How can we go up? <laughs> Need to try again. And up. Yeah. I love the music, man. So oh, relaxing. I'm gonna need this to jump on the slide, I think. Keep going, Soviet soldier.
Okay. Okay. Can hold this. <laughs> Whoa. New path for us to travel upon. I couldn't believe it. I still struggle to believe it. A whole lost city, buried in that jungle deep below the crust of the earth. Who would have thought it was possible? Who indeed? It is of course a shame you didn't think to record the moment for posterity and help us all to get over our disbelief. But I did, General, I did! My training was excellent, and I immediately took out my Kamsamolyats and began to document all I could. <laughs> to go up here. Um, I think this thing can move as well, isn't it? Yeah, it can move. Where is this camera now, then? Ah, General, yes. <laughs> what, of course, I, I meant to say was my training was excellent, and I immediately reached for my camera, only to realize it must have been torn from my utility belt in the crash and lost forever in that forgotten jungle. That makes a lot of excuses, man. Returned. Oh, he's was back here. hungrier than ever. Perhaps it was angry it had been fooled by an egg-wearing idiot. That is unkind, General. It may have been small of brain, but it was grand of stature. Whereas you, Ivan Ivanovich, are lacking in both departments. Presuming there were no more eggs to hide in, did you have a new plan? I did, General. Please, do tell me, what was this brilliant plan? I ran like hell, General.
You run like hell, my friend. Will our intrepid yet doomed hero survive the jaws of the ferocious dinosaur? Will he meet his end miles underground as an aperitif for a ravenous raptor? What dark secrets could be buried in the lost city of Agatha? Will the general ever discover the location of his lost bomb? All of these questions and more will be answered in the next exciting episode of Little Orpheus! Okay guys, so this completes uh, the chapter one, uh, or rather episode one of uh, Little Orpheus. We'll see you in the next episode. Should be interesting. We'll see how it goes. The overall, uh, this looks uh, quite a promising game. Uh, nine episodes. This is the first episode, so shouldn't last long. I think uh, maybe I'll com combine uh, two episodes in the next episode. So we'll meet in the next video with the new episodes of this Little Orpheus. Till then, have a good day. And good night. Whatever.